All right, what's good, everybody? It's your boy Aso and Edge LC. Today, we have something amazing. Toji Fushi Girl has dropped in Mugen. Shout out to my boy Soulfire. He dropped this character. And I'm not going to lie, I stayed up all 24 hours editing him, creating new moves and modes to make this character insane. This man, Toji Fushi Girl, went crazy in the anime. So we had to see what he can do in Mugen. I'm not going to lie, he was one of my favorite characters in JJK. And Toji is just a menace among menace. We're going to see what he can do against many different characters on the roster and see how strong Toji Zenin is as it all know this is my edit and see what he can do as you all know he will be joining the tournament of anime but we're gonna see what he can do and go all around if y'all want this character join the discord down below we're gonna be showing him every single day going live every single day and editing and working on more characters so hope you enjoy and let's get right into the video of toji zenny boy i'm a legend but spell my presence don't touch me i'm ready my drip like hokage see you and i we both had nothing in common i'm more like kakashi i do shit bro let's go let's go just you know be from the unknown said i gotta show that i'm with it i got cuts so not tell fast i kill him we all cut thoughts had to put the work in show him what the work is came up from the bottom now i'm up though hey all right, what's good, everybody? It's Shiba Iso, and yes, we are finally here with Toji Fushigoro, man. This character has just released yesterday. We stayed up all night making a nice edit of him, creating new forms and all types of new stuff for him. So if you guys want this private moving character of mine, make sure to join the Discord down below. Or if y'all want a character created, edited, etc., man, join the Discord below. I'm excited to see what this Toji can do, man. As y'all know, Toji is just one of my favorite characters inside of anime, and he is such a crazy character inside of Mugen. Now, let me tell you guys, he's up there with Sukuna and Gojo. We're going to be doing all types of different videos on him and everything, but let me know down below do y'all like this toji he was a quick edit as i said i did it in one full night so he's a little he doesn't have any like he's not really buggy but obviously you know he's a prototype so he's he's very nice and all that stuff if you guys want literally him or anything like that y'all know my discord man but i hope you'll enjoy it we got toji fushigoro man in the works man and now i'm excited to see what we do we're gonna put him against a couple people here today just as a showcase video and then we're probably gonna do moving online all types of stuff with him and all these other characters on the roster so i hope you'll enjoy and let's get right into toji fushigoro all right you guys as y'all see like i said we're here with toji fushigoro and when i tell y'all we were working on this character man me and a couple of people on my team shout out my boy koro and jt man and it just was like a straight grind fest you feel me he's very strong you know he's he's very fast he has a lot of different things in his kit and it's just exciting to see my boy finally in Mugen, man like it's been a it's been a very long time coming obviously and he just you know it's, it's, he's just he's just a tough character okay he has a lot of different things in his kit a lot of different things that he does as y'all know like feel me he, he's on the jjk team so y'all know that he does uh he's with sakuna gojo yuta etc all those different people and it's nice to see what he can do as uh, obviously with them Okay, told you getting close. Comboing up a little bit. And he, he can combo off the ground with his little stomp. He does have new features and new moves coming very, very soon. So, like, he literally has a lot of different things he can do, obviously. And it, it, all around, it, as y'all know, Yuta not weak. Him and Yuta is a nice little match. They both like to combo a little bit. And, you know, it's, it's nice to see both of these characters shine. But he does have a mode, feel me, that's gonna... I think that make the difference in him versus Yuta. They both have their own little modes. Here we go. We got Yuta going to his mode early. And, uh... Same thing with Toji, too. I think Toji's obviously going to pop his mode as well if uh, he gets the time to. There we go. Okay. Those who inherited the curse of the Zenin family and the one who couldn't fully okay. As y'all know, like I said, he has his transformation to put him into Toji Zenin. It completely changes his palette as well as a lot of moves that he can do. And it just makes his character such a monster, man. Him and Yuta are, like I said, a good matchup, but like as y'all see he's just a monster when he goes into that toji zenny mode we're gonna see that fight one more time because i feel like you know him yuta is definitely a tough matchup it gave him a good fight let me know if y'all do like that transformation into some of the stuff that came with toji and like i said he's just he's one of my favorite characters in moving now like he's definitely a character i love to watch he has a cool little transformation animation it took a little while but like i said everything's gonna look even better this is a beta and shit y'all let me know if y'all think i'm getting a little better with the characters i feel like this one's better than some things i did before because obviously he's not buggy but this boy Toji, he be putting in that work. No cap. He'll catch you, combo you. He be having his flash step and everything. And his his mode, obviously, is something that we never got to see in the show too much. You know, him and his prime, as well as having the inverted spear of heaven and the worm. So it's cool to see all that on one character. So it's like, damn, bro. This nigga Toji, feel me? He has some nice little things in his kit that could go crazy. But, you know, like I said, he'll, this is new. He'll probably be even more edited and updated by tomorrow. You know, not, not to make him too broken, but just new things in his kit, new moves that I'm going to create and stuff like that. But, um, Yuta is giving him a time. I'm not going to lie. Okay. As y'all know, Rika is an annoying thing to fight. That's one thing you told you be having a little bit of a problem with. Okay. Caught him with the inverted spear heaven. Rika is stopping him from moving, though. She's not letting him do it. And here we go. <laughs> Let me know if y'all like this little dialogue I added, too, because I just feel like it was cool. They would all bear witness. 
If y'all if y'all did watch TikTok, then y'all know what it is. It's like the one who was free with the Hunter X Hunter narrator, what was supposed to be the narrator for Toji Fuji Goro. But we're gonna see the next fight. We'll be right back. All right, we gotta put him against some of the top tiers. You know, we gotta put him against people like Luffy, Gojo, Sakuna, because feel me, he's just an extremely cool character. He's extremely strong, and we gotta see where he ranks. You know, feel me? I feel like he's one of the top people in the tournament. I think he could get to at least top five, or top ten, pretty easily. And he's not weak. You see, he has the combos. He knows how to combo his moves together. He just has to, you know, the only thing that be getting him is like sometimes, you know, his kit is nice and he does a lot of things, but he wastes his meter sometimes. So sometimes he can get comboed up and he can, like, you know, obviously get get hurt from it. Okay. Okay. Luffy getting some nice combos on. Let me find out Luffy got it in him. Okay. Okay. Told you with the inverted spear heaven. Okay. There we go. If you guys want to understand his kit and all types of stuff, like I said, I explained it down below in the Discord. Like, in terms of what he has, in terms of what auto-dodge and stuff like that. He doesn't actually have auto-dodge. He has different things in his kit that simulate, you know, to make him a lot stronger. But, uh, you would have to see it to understand it. Those who inherited the curse of the Zen yep, and this is where it starts to get crazy. As you'll see, he doesn't get too much health back. I didn't want to, feel me, drag it out, make it too OP or anything like that. Because he's already a lot stronger inside of his mode, feel me? But, uh... You know, his mode is where he starts changing stuff up because he has new moves in his mode. He combos a lot of moves together in his mode and he just he'll chase you down. It's not like he's OP or he has mad helpers and stuff or a lot of different things that are coming out and, you know, making it so you can't move and stuff. He, he just he just genuinely likes to box. You know what I mean? He just genuinely likes to box and he'll catch you in that corner. And you feel me? He, he does get active. As y'all see, he likes combo and stuff together. No cap. All I want the inverted spear heaven, and then he combos you down, getting crazy. Let me know if y'all like those pallets and the sprites and everything, but let's get into the next match of the video. All right, I'm not gonna lie to you. Feel me? Y'all probably like, yo, this boy wasting time. I'm trying to see the top players against him. Feel me? Luffy is one of the tops, but we know Levi is one of the top. Like, him, Gojo, Sukuna, and feel me? They're like the top three right now, in my opinion, that, that y'all know of. There's actual people in the tournament who are a little stronger than them, but feel me? Y'all don't know about these people, obviously, you know, so I'm, I'm not gonna spoil it. I'm gonna let y'all see for yourself who is up there with some of the some of the characters inside of the tournament obviously but um these are two of my favorite characters man i love to you levi i love toji and you know toji's not gonna have easy time like i said as somebody who can get comboed you no know, like the without the auto dodge without all that stuff etc he's not a character who can you know some, take down some of these high tiers sometimes well he can take them down but he's not gonna get out of their combos and stuff sometimes like feel me he can take a lot of damage at once and levi's somebody who will dish it out to you you know what i mean but He's, he's also somebody who can give you some damage you know he can combo you do a lot of different things in his kit and i feel like this is just he's just a smooth character all around okay okay into his slashes into the inverted spear up comboing off the ground and he's not gonna let you leave he's not gonna let you leave you know feel me? he's not gonna let you leave okay as you'll see he's about even a little bit I'm not gonna lie, he's getting with levi right now but he's like around their level feel me he's like on that little spectrum of all those characters levi gojo sakuna he definitely lands in there and the one who couldn't fully leave behind that curse. <laughs> I'll be trying to be quiet when he transforms so y'all can hear the dialogue. But as y'all see, y'all know he does go crazy once he transforms. That's one thing. He'll chase you down. He likes the combo. And, he, you know, he just gets a little bit more meter in mode so he can combo you down. Oh, he missed the ult, man. I got to make that hitbox bigger for the ultimate. I feel like it's, like, genuinely almost impossible to land. But, you know, I don't know for sure. But we're going to get into one of the final fights. We got to see what he does against people like Sakuna. All right, this is the latest Sakuna, one that took down Gojo. I'm not gonna lie, Toji actually has a harder fight with Gojo than Sakuna. It's actually kind of funny, but you know, we're gonna see what he can do obviously against Sakuna. Like this is gonna be obviously a good little matchup. Two of the higher people in the tournament, very high tiers. You know, Sakuna, he just had his showcase video. So, you know, I feel like Gojo deserves one too because I actually never got to do one for him. But, um, okay. Okay, Toji starting off strong, catching him with the combo, bouncing off the floor. Sakuna getting out of the combo with his uh rabbit escape. That rabbit escape is crazy sometimes. Okay. Ryoman Sakuna. Oh now he's not playing with Toji no more. Okay. Let me know if y'all want to see some moving, like obviously, you know, with the, with the AI co-op shit. Like if I do uh Sakuna, Toji, Toji, Gojo, you know, all types of stuff. I would love to play as Toji. Feel me, add Gojo to my team or something like that. And see what me and the AI could do, obviously. Feel me? Oh my god, I'm not gonna lie. Go Toji taking that bleed damage. He getting beat up by Sakuna in this corner. It's not easy. It's not easy versus the King of Curses. Y'all already know that, though. I ain't even have to say that. Y'all already knew that. Okay. And there we go. 
told you going into his mode, this is where it's fun to get serious. I feel like, you know, I, I just wanted to add this. I was going to make it so he came out of Mega Me's domain, but like it was like a very hard thing to do. So feel me. I, we, we, we got this though. We got, we got, we got something nice. Oh, he catches Sakuna falling down. He said, where are you going, my boy? Mm-hmm. Catches him, inverted spear of heaven, and Okuna's not leaving. He said, we're going to leave you where you stand, my boy. Oh, so this nigga froze him. Okay, we're gonna do a two-round fight for that, feel me? End off the video with something clean. Because I know I know this is what y'all wanna see. I'm definitely gonna do a part two because I know y'all probably wanna see him versus Gojo as well as some other people. Like I said, I, we've seen him lose to Gojo many times. We've seen him lose to Sukuna as well. Sukuna can't get right with him. But um You know, it's it's scary. It's a very scary addition. He was supposed to be in the last tournament I did, but obviously, as y'all know, he didn't drop until then. Shout out to my boy Soulfire Man crazy creation i'll have the link to uh, you know the original character if you guys want the character without my form and without my moves and all that stuff literally from soul fire if y'all want my version like i said i have it in the discord down below just because it's, that's the easiest place for me to drop the whole character but um let me know if y'all like some of his combos feel me i feel like that's one thing i was able to really get right with this character oh nah oh nah this boy sakuna not playing with him he said i'm countering all that oh my god look at that counter damage Oh yeah. Alright, Sakuna. You wanna get serious, Sakuna? We can get we can get serious too, Sakuna. No cap. Air witness. Yup, okay. Let me know if y'all like the e human awakening. Like I said, still brand new. But um he gonna catch you in that combo and he gonna he gonna leave you there. He, he gonna do it to you. All his moves together, he likes to stack them, as y'all know. He he do be going crazy. But Sakuna not weak neither. Oh my god. Okay. As I said, he's relative to these people, obviously. Feel me? Are we going to round three? Are we going to round three? Are we going to? Oh, wait a minute! Oh, wait a minute! <laughs> Yo, him and Sakuna go off. That boy countered Sakuna last second, and that's Toji Zenin, man. Y'all, let me know down below if y'all enjoy that character, if y'all want him, and feel me if y'all ready for V2. Whenever I do make that, make sure to stay in tune for more videos, man. I hope y'all enjoyed. And like I said, man. Oh, also, I want to say that I am going to be streaming today, no, no, tomorrow, and the day after, and every single day after that on YouTube and Twitch. But YouTube streams are going to be shorter and have less Mugen and all that types of stuff. So make sure to sub to both, man. If y'all want to see a lot of Mugen and a lot of other stuff, make sure to go sub to the Twitch down below, and it's in my Discord. So join my Discord if y'all want to see all that. We're streaming every single day, and every day that I miss a stream, I'm giving away. A whole, a whole lot of money feel me i'm giving away money 50 100 dollars inside of the discord to random people on live so you guys get to see feel me if y'all want a chance at winning that <laughs> join the discord down below man because i, I, I feel me, we got to stay consistent so i hope you all enjoyed it iso gang we out here